What is up, folks? Welcome to another edition of Billy the Kid's No Bullshit Toy Reviews, or as this guy would say, Ba Weep Grand I Weep Ninny Bong. Uh, today we're going to take a look at KFC Keith's Fantasy Club's Crash Hog, which is a masterpiece offering of Rekgar from Transformers the Movie, as well as Season 3 of the Generation 1 television show. This is a beautifully made figure. It comes with a plethora of junk, accessories, all that fun shit. Comes in this box here. Very well done. Beautiful artwork. And it has a window view. Also gives you a little bit of a bio. The artwork in this is absolutely stellar. Accessories, you've got this little bin thing that he bangs on. cock a doodle -doo, Happy motoring! Uh, this thing opens up and you can throw other accessories inside for storage. He comes with TV. You took some TV? And now the news. Don't touch that dial. This axe here, which is something that he uh, used to fight Springer in the movie. This comes apart. Pieces and all. And uh, they become the shocks for his motorcycle mode. So everything is used. I didn't open these, but he comes with a couple uh, rifles, as well as the mirrors here for his motorcycle mode. He comes with a tech spec card, and a comic book. Again, stellar art. The artwork in this is awesome. Just gives you a little story as to who these guys are. And then step-by-step uh, -step photos on how to transform him into his motorcycle mode. But enough of that shit. Let's get right into it. Here is Masterpiece Rekgar. Or Crash Hog. Whatever you'd like to call him. He's beautiful. There's not much to complain about here aside from this. He's got this butt flap. I kind of wish that you would have been able to twist it around to come up behind, but, uh, you know, most of us don't look at him from the back. So from this view, he looks great. A lot of metal, feet are die cast, thighs are die cast. I think that's it in terms of die cast. Head is on a ball joint, so... Head's on a hinge, so you can turn left, you can turn right. He looks up, he looks down. These little handlebars here are posable, so you can have them disappear, or you can have them point out like antenna. Pistol tits don't have any attachment for blast effects, but they are there. Ratchet joints here at the shoulder for a full 360. Ratchet joints come up so far. You've got, you can remove the wheels. Um, a lot of things you can remove on this guy, actually. Um, you've got the bicep swivel. You've got double jointed elbow. So excellent range of posability. You've got swivel at the wrist. Thumb is fully posable. These are the KFC hands. These hands are pretty stellar. Um, every digit is posable. They're all on hinges and a base ball joint. So you can make a closed fist. You can give the middle finger. You can have him grip. You can do just about anything. You can do anything you want with these hands. But it requires a little bit of work. And honestly, it's more work than I like to put into my toys. You've got... A ratchet at the waist, but you get a full waist rotation. Plop these up, and you can get the full Van Dam. The legs, let's pick these up again. The legs, once you move this flap, kick up so far. And only kick back. So far, 
they've got a thigh swivel and they've got let me pop this wheel off a bend at the knee so far uh, there is a bend at the foot so the toes bend down so far they pivot slightly that much that is it the spikes here on the shoulders and the knees are interchangeable you can put them anywhere you want that has a hole on this so if you want to put them in here you can put them in here you can put them up top put them down low you can pretty much customize him to look any way you wish he scales beautifully with the other Masterpiece Transformers figures. Yeah, he scales wonderfully with the Ocular Max Springer. So, highly recommend this guy. I'm going to get him into his bike mode and I'll give you my final thoughts. All right, so here we have Crash Hug in his motorcycle mode. He looks good from this angle. He looks good from this angle. He looks good from here. He looks good from there. Uh, he has stabilizers built in. Down here, just flip those up. And he rolls. These are not soft. These are hard as a motherfucker. These could hurt you. But everything spins nicely. Um, if you don't want to use the stabilizers, you can stand up in bicycle mode without them. All in all, this guy's pretty fucking awesome. You can get him uh, just about anywhere. Uh, I got mine from my sponsors at the link below, Big Ten Robot Toys and Collectibles. Do me a favor, check out my Patreon if you like what you see. Support me, help me buy shit I don't need so you can decide if you need it. As well, give me a like and a subscribe. I greatly appreciate it. This is Billy the Kid, signing off.